Hi, this is Mr. West, and today you're watching a special Valentine's Cartesian art coordinates tutorial video from MathDrills.com. Make sure to check out MathDrills for tons of other great resources, but for this one, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be applying the principles of coordinate plane geometry to making a picture just in time for Valentine's Day. How does this work? Well, we have four, uh, five different lines, actually, that we have here. And we're going to plot each point and connect the line. So with line one, we're going to color it pink. Okay, and as we go, we're going to make dots and connect these dots. Each one of these sets of parentheses is a coordinate, one of those dots. The first number will indicate how far we move to the right. So if we go down here to our grid that's attached in this uh, PDF file, you're going to see on the uh, we have this x axis that's going to be the first number in the parentheses okay that's always to the right okay and the second number is the y coordinate and that indicates how far we go up so if we go over here to our first point we see that it's going to be four to the right and we're going to go eight units up as indicated by the four in the first slot and then eight in the second slot so let me go ahead and show you what that looks like so we're going to go ahead and plot that point four eight and there it is okay so then we're going to go here to our next point and we're going to go to 412. So we're going to keep it uh, in the same X coordinate. We're still going to go 4 to the right, but now we're going to go 12 units up. Okay, and we're going to make another point. Now, after we're done with that, we're going to connect our lines, and then we just keep going. So it's pretty simple. We're just going to keep uh, making this in one color. Then I'm going to switch to another color, and then switch to another color for each one of these. And you're going to see that it loops around, and it's going to make a figure. It's not going to look like it makes anything at first, but when you're done, you're going to see it makes something that's pretty nice just in time for Valentine's Day. So let me go ahead, and I'm going to fast forward through this. If you want to follow along or pause, go ahead and do that. But I'm going to go ahead and quickly do this. So stay tuned. So you can see that I'm done. I already uh, plotted all my points and you can see that it says love just in time for Valentine's Day. And I'm gonna go ahead and color it too. Okay, I think that adds a lot of flair to it. You don't have to do this, obviously it's already complete, but I'm gonna go ahead and do this just because I think it makes it look a lot better. So I'm gonna use purple for this first L. Okay, and that's what it suggests. Now you don't have to follow exactly what it says in the uh, coordinate list. You can use different colors, but I just wanted to stick pretty much with the script. Okay, and let's make it a little bit bigger. That will make it go faster. Okay. Okay, and I, I can go outside the lines, and I can just erase it later. And I'm going to do that. I'm going to make it a little bit faster here. And I'll just erase it when I'm done. And there's tons of other uh, great math drills coordinate plane worksheets if you like doing these. I personally do. Um, they have them for all the holidays and also for other events too, like the World Cup. So make sure to check those out. So I'm done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out more videos I have for Math Drills on my Math Drills playlist. And I look forward to seeing you next time right here on West Explains Best.